Hi guys! Today I'm going to show you how to make another super easy Japanese recipe. This time we are going to use cucumber, which is a very popular ingredient in Japan, especially during the summer, because it is said that cucumber helps fight summer fatigue. First, let's check out the ingredients. So to make this recipe, you're going to need soy sauce, sesame oil, try and pick a tasty one, vinegar, I would recommend rather a white type vinegars like apple vinegar, like I have today, or rice vinegar, um, cider vinegar, then salt, and of course, a cucumber. Next, you're going to peel off half of the skin of your cucumber to make it pretty, but also to help the mixture soak in more quickly. Once you've peeled your cucumber, cut off the edges. And then what usually Japanese people do is they don't cut it nicely. Uh, what they do is that they kind of beat up <laughs> the cucumber, which I do not like doing because what they want to do is to make uneven bits. So what you can do is just cut first your cucumber with your hands. Uh, making the cucumber cuts uneven helps the liquid soak in. So what I do when it gets hard to cut with my hands, I just put a slight cut with my knife in the cucumber and then finish cutting it with my hands. Voilà, comme ça. But if you prefer to use something to crush it a little bit before, it's up to you guys. Voila. So we've cut our cucumber and what we are going to use to soak uh, the cucumber in the mixture of soy sauce, uh, sesame oil and salt is that we are going to use a plastic bag. It's very common in Japanese households to do pickles, to make pickles and um, when you have to soak in ingredients in some kind of liquid mixture, it's very common to use plastic bags here. So that's what we are going to do. Up. So let's put all the cucumber in the bag. And then also what is good is that once your ingredients are in the bag, this kind of mixture, you can keep your cucumber for a few days into the mixture that will not spoil the uh, cucumber. It will, on the contrary, help you keep your cucumber for many days in the refrigerator. Alors, our first ingredients, we're going to put some salt, about two pinches of salt, mix, then add the sesame oil, two spoons, vinegar, two spoons, Soy sauce, two spoons too. So just mix your cucumber, then put the air out, seal your bag, ziplock, and uh, keep it at least 30 minutes in the refrigerator before eating. And once you've soaked the cucumber for at least 30 minutes, it's ready. And after that, you can keep it for four or five days easy. So that goes in the fridge. 
elle n'a plus qu'à attendre. So our cucumber has been in the fridge for about half an hour. So it's ready to eat. So you just put your cucumber in a plate. And if you like sesame seeds, you can also sprinkle a little bit. Well, I love sesame so and there you are with a lovely summer refreshing dish let's try it itadakimasu mm. oh my god i love this taste and the cucumber is so crunchy So what I love to do also is use this cucumber with somme. You know those noodles that we like to enjoy during the summer? Because not only does cucumber match well the somme, that's something we, we match with them very often, but also what is good is that the mixture we soaked the cucumber in can be used as a tsuyu for the noodles, so you don't need to buy any sauce. You will see it really matches the soma. Voila, you have your men tsuyu. Benny de show. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Please let me know if you make it because I'm always curious to know uh, how it turns out and how you like it. Please do not forget to subscribe and I will see you very soon on a date or for more cooking for lazy people. See you soon. Bisous. Bye guys.